Welcome to Obsidian TTRPGTutorials.com. Let's learn how to use the tool. Alright, g'day guys, and welcome back today to another Obsidian video. Today we're going to be having a look at folder notes. Uh, we've seen a lot of feedback recently of people coming into the, uh, the Discord and saying, hey, my folder notes isn't working anymore. What's going on? Um, and if we jump into settings and go through to community plugins and browse and do a search for folder notes, let's just talk through this. A lot of us historically have used Aiden X's, L Aiden LX's folder notes. Uh, alongside the folder note core plugin, you needed to use both of them together. Um, but as you can see, that's not been updated in a year. Um, and Obsidian changes quite constantly. Uh, that plugin has not been maintained and people are now reporting that it's stopping working. So what I would recommend you do is you go ahead and uninstall both of these, all right? They're no longer functional, all right? There is a fix in the GitHub if you're really dead set on staying with Aiden LX's folder notes, but it's just as easy to un uninstall them, all right? And have a look at the new options that are available. So folder notes by Lost Pool, you can see it's been updated 10 days ago, all right? And it's already getting the same sort of downloads that everyone's, uh, as the other ones have previously had. All right, so go ahead and install that one. All right, do the install, do the enable, as with anything, go through and have a look at the documentation and download links. Uh, you can have a look at the options. Now, I'll just say here that I have not spent a lot of time with the options for this plugin, all right? Because frankly, I don't need it, all right? Um, the important thing down here for me is the key for creating a folder note. Um, I like to just create folder notes manually. I don't want every folder to be a folder note. I'd, I'd like to decide when that happens. Um, but just so you know, there is the possibility in here to automatically create folder notes when you create folders, if that's what you would like. Now, for those of you saying, what the hell is a folder note? What are you talking about? We can make a folder, all right? Now, a folder is just a folder. And if we right click, we can go new note inside of that folder. Where do I put it? I've got a folder, I've got a note. All right, you can write in a note, obviously but you can't write in a folder. Folder note allows you to control click the folder and now this is a note. All right, that's it. It just allows you to put a note into a folder. Now, if we actually open this in the System Explorer, we can see here that we have our vault. We have a folder called a new folder. And if we go inside there, we now have a note called a new folder. All right. In the background, what this plugin is doing is very simple. It's creating a note that is the same name as the folder, okay? And then it's just displaying that as a link in the folder instead, all right? So technically that note does reside inside of that folder, all right? So that's an important thing to take away. Um, but that's it, it's really, really useful. Um, if we have a look at the situations where I might use this, here we go, so I'll have a look at the party screen actually. I've got a folder for my Deadly Depth in, all right, which is my party. Now, if I have a look at that, I've actually got an overview page on that note. And then inside of that, I have notes, all right, for my different players that are in my party. All right, so what I like to use a folder note over for is that high level summary of whatever that thing is. All right, it might be a region, all right, a folder for a region or a folder for a continent in your world. And inside of that, you can then have more folders with other locations and inside of that notes with other locations. So I might have a, a folder for a city that I turn into a folder note. That note is about the city. And then underneath that folder notes for every region within that city, I turn those into folder notes. And then within that, I have the buildings or the key or core, core buildings that are important for those regions, right? Something like that. It allows you to add structure and depth, but use your folder in a way that actually means something for your data layout. Um, so yeah, that's it. It's very, very simple. Um, for those of you who are migrating over, I did not find any issues. It was literally a case of uninstall and reinstall. Um, if you have done something funny, like, you know, maybe you're using Aiden X's folder notes and you, you picked a different naming convention, you might have some issues, all right? I've never changed anything. I just leave it as the same name as the folder, all right? And the benefit of that is that the two plugins just work perfectly. Um, if you have gone with custom names, you may need to do a bit more work to massage this in. But yeah, look, outside of that, that is Folder Notes by Lost Paul. That is the one that we're now recommending that you use. It's super simple and it's on my like core list of stuff. Like it, I will 
never have a vault. It doesn't have a Foldernet plugin installed, right? It's just one of my first plugins that I install, and it's a fantastic, easy one. Does what it says on the box, so that's all that matters. All right, let's leave it there. Short and simple. Have a great day. Hope you're enjoying your Easter. If you are, are watching this live, that's the time that it comes out. Um, apart from that, I guess I'll speak to you on the socials. Enjoy.